Hello everyone, it's Attack of Summit 2 here, and for today, we have gotten ourselves a mix of Smash Brothers and Nintendo news for today's video. And so the topic we are about to discuss for today, earlier this year, we've been getting a couple of Amiibo for the second Fighters Pass, being Min Min from ARMS and Steve and Alex from Minecraft. Min Min first released in spring of 2022 this year, while Steve released at around a few months ago at around September. So the only characters so far that has been, you know, shown to be get an Amiibo, is Sephiroth, Pyramidra, and Kazuya. We do get to see a brief look at Sephiroth and Kazuya's amiibo thanks to a screenshot that I found on Twitter a couple months ago, but now Nintendo has officially shown a full look at most of the amiibo that they shown for the second Fighters Pass and along with a release date for a few of them. Now, as you can see here from the official Nintendo of America Twitter, here's what they have to announce about the upcoming Amiibo for the DLC Fighters from Smash Bros. Ultimate. It says, Super Smash Bros. Amiibo for DLC Fighters Kazuya and Sephra will be released on January 13th, 2023. Plus, look forward to release of Pyra and Mifra in 2023. And here they show a video of every four of all the four Amiibos right here. And I must say, show them side by side and especially from all the details is extraordinary to look at. So let's look each of them one by one. First we got the Kazuya amiibo. You can tell from all the details from the scars, the details on his gi, and especially that red eye shown here to kind of signify his double gene. You can tell they went out on all the details. Next is Sephiroth, which we can all agree is the best looking amiibo design just from details alone. Going from his sword, the Masamune, his jacket, and especially the one wing itself you can see all the details in the feathers and i'm not gonna lie if i wanted to, if i was a, an amiibo collector i would basically buy the sephira amiibo uh, immediately i only have free mario related amiibo sadly and not any smash Bros. related ones but maybe this could be something i can come back with and then last but not least as you saw right there we do get to see a brief moment of pyra and mifra xenoblade characters in terms of design are pretty much hard to you know hard to model so i can tell them that the production is pretty hard to do which is kind of why we don't really get an exact release date for the two aside from them coming out next year while this is all fine and dandy and all and really exciting the only character so far well the only character as of right now that hasn't got an amiibo at all is sora from kingdom hearts when they announced sora last year and showed the amiibo lines for the remaining DLC characters for the second Fighters Pass. The only ones that, that the only one that wasn't shown was Sora, which is so weird given his status as the final character. Could this mean that Sora may not be getting an amiibo at all? Well, most likely, most likely, I would say that he is definitely gonna get an amiibo. Some would like to argue that it's probably due to Disney being stingy and all. When to be fair, we would have never gotten Sora to begin with if Disney would never say no. Plus. Disney never wanted to say no to begin with because, come on, we know that this is Disney we're talking about. They want the money, so it's really weird how Sora so far has not got an Amiibo announcement, and the fact that Nintendo hasn't announced anything at all is really, really strange. I really hope he gets an Amiibo one day, but who knows? We'll have to find out in the future. But I hope you all enjoyed this brand new news video of the upcoming remaining Smash Bros. Amiibo. And I want to know all your thoughts and opinions down below. Which of these Amiibo will you be getting first? Do you think you'll be getting Sephiroth and Kazuya first? And are you excited for the remaining ones such as Pyre and Mithra? And do you think Sora at all will be getting his own Amiibo very soon? If not, then, then yeah, that's going to be one of the strangest decisions I've seen in video games in my opinion. But with that, leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell for more videos follow my twitter and i'll see you guys next time and remember this once a legend always a legend like a